back in the city unfulfilled what the f is that the ghost what's that he's having a storm moment yeah that's a ghost okay hey am i right in thinking you can actually see me <laughs> of all the things so the ghostly riding's finally spotted by a living being and it turns out to be a cute little doggy Why are you staring at me like that? Okay, so I don't have any legs. But isn't that normal for a ghost in Nippon? I was killed by a bolt of lightning, you know. It's great. I never get hungry. I never tire. It's, it's, it's fun all the way. <laughs> alright, well, I'm glad he's doing alright. There's just one problem. You have to talk to me in shifts. It keeps kicking you out over and over again like some kind of Souls game. I've realized that it's not always easy for ghosts. I mean... It can actually get a bit boring floating about every day. And no one can see me, so it gets lonely at times. Still, it's great fun most of the time. I should be able to enjoy using my spooky powers. Uh... No. Oh. Huh. Why, though? <laughs> I don't know if I actually got anything resembling a quest out of that. He's just hanging out. <laughs> Sup? I'm riding. That strange mist that we, we have all over town was gone. Uh... That was all over town has gone now. But my father still hasn't been able to wake up. Rumor has it it was the mist making everybody ill. So I want the gods to make my father better now. All I need is medicine. Then I can make him well. But I'd never get enough money to buy something like that. Herbal medicine? How frustrating. It's available nearby, but I can't get any. Somebody help my father. All I need is medicine. Then I can make him well. But I'd never have to make... Okay. Yeah, that's just at the store. I don't know if I can afford... Ah, uh, maybe... Mm. I feel like I got pretty low. I might have accidentally skipped something here. I wasn't expected to talk for so long. Yeah, this, it's why it can be nice just to have dialogue, like a talk option and then a store option, because sometimes I'm just trying to do something, man. I didn't know I was going to get into like a whole thing. Carrying one out of one, one out of one. Okay, so I might want to get that for a quest then. Sounds like it might be for something like that. I... <laughs> I don't believe it. Is that what I think it is, doggy? You've got some herbal medicine there, haven't you? How could a dog manage to get a hold of something so expensive? Uh, look at my sword, lady. <laughs> it costs like a hundred of those or something. Why are you looking at me like that? Do you want me to have it? I don't believe it. You must have been sent by the gods, doggy. Thank you, thank you. Now I can make pot better at last. I didn't buy it at first because I thought it was a consumable for me, and I'm like... Antidotes? I almost never need those... ...in games. And even when I do, I tend to not use them, except for Souls games, where it's like, Oh fuck, oh fuck, here, here we go again! They make... <laughs> freaking Elden Ring makes being poisoned into an urgent situation. <laughs> Pop? Is the medicine working? Oh, please let it work. I just want you to wake up, that's all. I want to hear your voice again. <gasps> what? Blossoms. Cherry blossoms. Gramps, you awake? Phew, that's a relief. Pop woke up. I managed to make him wake up. I feel like I'm dreaming. Thank you, doggy. Thank you so much. I'll stay right by his side till he's completely better. 
Well, okie dokie then, bye forever. Now this actually kind of feels like it's the real town of the game. It's, it's pretty big and there's a lot of characters and it kind of seems like there's a bunch of side quests here and there. This guy's here again? Okay, I kind of get the feeling that the uh, the taxi service stuff is like an opportunity for uh, money grinding or something. I could be wrong, but I feel like I never saw a teleport spot in this town. But I'm not totally sure. I'm just gonna backtrack for a while until I can teleport back. I don't know if I know a single teleport spot. I might end up just having to walk all the way back to the shrine where she went back to. Which I believe is the same place where we met Mr. Bamboo. Sorry if I'm wrong. I don't think they're on like the map or anything. That appears to be on the map. <laughs> that's a save point and that's a vortex, right? Okay, now I'm wrong. So let's, let's try to find it. The area is so full of water that I don't know where the, uh, the specific thing is. It definitely felt like a place that should have one. Wow, I am on fire today. I feel as light as anything now that the mist lifted from the city. No time to lose then. Super fast Hayate has got to get back to work. You were my least favorite ninja in D Dead or Alive. Huh, what do you want? What's with the cheeky twinkle in your eye, pooch? You want a race? Okay, super fast Hayate is going to give you a run for your money. Wait, we whoa, whoa. Ready, go. I can be a dirty hacker cheater boy or not. Are you just going fast anyway? Are those spike balls? Are you leaving behind spike balls? Where are we racing to? I don't know where we're racing to. Bye, I guess. <laughs> Did I win? He's gone. Uh... <laughs> Alright, well... <laughs> I feel like we didn't actually have an agreed upon course to race through, so I'm not really clear on what we're going to do there. Look how small the town is! This itty bitty miniature. It's really goofy. Gives you this sense that we're like looking at a map from a weird perspective, like in Golden Sun. Is it up here or something, maybe? Nope. God damn it. Uh, I don't see it anywhere. What is it, Mutt? You want to see my monster manifest? I'm afraid that's not possible. Contains names of the mo Oh, fuck. I forgot it's him. That's why he wants to talk more. Was it outside the village? Not exactly in the fast travel experience because I'm having trouble finding the thing. I thought it was indicating that's inside the village. Ah, I keep pressing select, hoping that it'll take me straight to the map, like a lot of games do. Where is it? <laughs> it says it's behind me, so it is in town. Do you have to go all the way to the second half of the town? I should learn where this is because otherwise I'm gonna lose a lot of time doing this path since this is like the location this chapter takes place in. But where the heck? Please default to the map. 
Oh, it's all the way in the back corner of that area. I don't think I've seen it before, but I could be wrong. The duration of playing this game is definitely padded out a bit by the uh, the amount of dialogue and just the amount of like huge areas you have to run through every time you go somewhere. It is a game that taketh its sweet time, damn it. I really wish the select opened the map. It's over this bridge, then over that bridge. All the way over here. I think this was bad, bad the first time I came by. I don't think I could come here originally. Bow, 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 bow. Bow, 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 bow. One bro. One. They're giving me one at a time. How dare. Sauce a sanctuary. Meow. I forgot there's an entire place full of bird people. <laughs> We welcome all sorts of customers here, humans and animals alike. Customers are customers after all, we do our best to please all. Is she outside or is she upstairs or... Am I misremembering where she went? That would be unfortunate given how long I've spent trying to get here. Oh wow, that list got a lot shorter, okay. Bits and pieces of my memory are calling back to da 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 Go to Sasa Sanctuary. Okay, yeah, so she's here. Unless she's on the way here. Oh. <laughs> Flashbacks to knowing that I need to go to Kakariko Village in Ocarina of Time, but I'm going to it wrong somehow. Because the game has fast travel, but doesn't expect you to use fast travel. So if you enter it from the wrong side of town, the cutscene doesn't play, and you're like, I don't understand, I'm at the place where the story continues, but it does not continue. Wow. Just took your stuff. Oh yeah. Just taking all your- Oh man. Goodbye to all of your food. How's that feel? That is a huge go board! Well, like Tic Tac Go. Well, I've sure ended up in a funny place this time. Maybe the gods are telling me to rest. I have to be working hard. But a trader never rests. That's the salesman's curse. So if you've been sent to buy something up, pup, take a look. Okay. Sell new things. I don't have that much money, though. I should not sell those. Bark. I feel like those are supposed to be like luck or wealth charms. 
Oh wait, I think it's uh it's an uncompleted goal, right? You call you like put in the other eye when you've completed your goal. Don't go eating everything in sight. I'm trying to I'm trying to rats. I just want to rats. Two. Ah, it is you, isn't it? You're the one who rescued Chun. Tell me, did you have to fight anyone? Was there a big battle? What kind of monsters did you have to fight? Tell me everything. Okay, bye. Ooh. Where are you, ma'am? No one's here. I'm so bored. I'm just killing time, really. I haven't gotten any work to do at all. Everyone else is running around. Like, maybe you're just not doing your work. It's him! It's gotta be him! <laughs> Dedicated dialogue every time I get one piece of food from them. They're all the salsa variations, so they- it's like, Oh my god, it's new and you've never had this before. Now you're all out of food. Whoa. Now there are wolves serving here. Yep, this sure is a strange inn, but the food is just great. Maybe I'm dreaming. I mean, an inn run by sparrows? When I was a kid, I helped an injured sparrow once. Now I feel like I'm being rewarded for it or something. I can't help thinking I'm getting extra special service somehow. Maybe you did. When I was just a girl, a hunter came to my aid when I was injured. I never imagined the same hunter would be staying here as a guest. It must- I must make sure he has everything he wants. Everything. Well, he clocked it. <laughs> he was... one hundo correcto. Take me places now. Oh. It take a long time to steal this stuff. Does there have to be an entire conversation every time I get an item? There's like a hundred items here. Oh, the dog. This just doesn't have to take this long. Oops. We've been waiting for you. you did a great job finding Chun. We want to thank you too. When I told Papa about everything you did, he was really surprised. Weren't you, Pop? I didn't even... I just went on with my life. I didn't even think to cut to... There was more to do here? Sure. Uh-oh. The boss is very impressed with you. Okay. We want to give you everything in these baskets as a reward. You can rest at the inn down below. And the hot spring behind the inn is great for relaxing. No, I liked it better when I felt like I was stealing from you. Oh, it's a pride tree. Doop, doop, doop. There's also a doggy. Oh, too many of these aren't money. There you go. I need a, I need a billion money. Because there's a... Like a backlog of things to purchase at this point. At least the techniques and whatnot. That's not a door, apparently. At least it doesn't open. Oh, he's covered in jelly donuts. Tweet, I've been waiting for you, White Wolf. You're the talk of the forest, you know. Did you really defeat a horrible monster? Tell me about it, please. Looks like you fu looks like you finally won Tweety over here for her ball. You're really a good guy after all. That means you can be my friend. I I'm gonna take good care of you, just like Take. We're never talking again. You're plucky, Master Scruffy, that's for sure. 
How can I want to run into the enemy's camp without any weapons or armor? I... Oh, uh, because you can't see my weapons or my markings. I just look like a gray wolf for you. So you can't see the giant fucking chainsaw sword on my back? Could it truly be? Shira, Shira Nui. No, uh, no other than the legendary white wolf could defeat Orochi. Hey, I was there too. Anyway, you protected the, the village all by yourself. Not too shabby. That's the whole conversation. Uh-oh. Boss is crying. So, uh, what's that supposed to mean? Huh? Just tweeting. Oh. She's fawning over one of us. Is it the horrible gremlin on my back? Or the four-legged wolf? Both options are red flags. <laughs> Alright, well, I found money, but not my goal. Well, luckily, well, well, luckily we're open again now. But Sasa Sanctuary is a land of fantasy, far from the human world. We barely get any guests. Yes, it's true. Bunch of birds. Does this lead to a place that she would potentially want to go, like, hang out at for reasons? It's either that or she couldn't get in. She might be out front. Tigers. Oh, no, here she is. The gods be praised, it really... Is it really you, Kaguya? I never thought I'd see you again after the Emperor suddenly summoned you to Cyan City. Kaguya, dear Kaguya. It feels like ages since we last met, Grandfather. My, look at those new wrinkles. Have I worried you so? Oh, Grandfather. I thought you guys would run into each other here. I'm happy for you too. Oh, Kaguya, let us live together happily ever after. We could s you could sell my bamboo ware, just you and me. Huh? Oh, uh... Huh? What's wrong, Kaguya? Do you have to return to the Emperor? No, that's not it, it's just... You said that in a really weird, kind of creepy way, honestly. Also, the angle of her head and her dome and the... Collar is getting weird. It's sticking straight up. It's an odd visual. It's just. I cannot live with you, grandfather. Huh? Huh? What are you talking about, Kaguya? You're not eloping or running away from something, are you? I didn't know you were here, grandfather. It would have been better if we had not met before I departed. Depart? Where are you going? I'm not sure. The royal crest carved into this earth here in Sasta Sanctuary, it calls to me. Na 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 What the? Kagia, what are you doing? It's as if I'm being driven by some invisible force. Below this crest, far below the earth. Something linked to my mysterious past awaits. I must go. I must see what lies within this hole. Hopefully it's not the end of Uzumaki. Whoops. Joining the flesh mob. Kaguya. No, don't do it, Bamboo Girl. It's too dangerous. After her, Ami. We're not, gonna, not even gonna jump in, huh? Just gonna fade away. Oh. Oh, it's one of these. Gotcha. Okay. 
I don't know why I did that when I was gonna have to go this way anyway. Can I zoom out more? Uh, probably here. Kamehame, bad ideas. Oh fuck. Uh, go, 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 go. Okay. Uh. Okay. No. Don't go that. Don't go that way. Don't go that way. <laughs> I can't dash. Oh no, I can. It's not in the air. Uh. Uh. I guess I gotta go this way? I don't know what else to do. What if that, but you worked this time? Thank you. Can I go? Please? God damn it. Alright. Sometimes the controls just feel weird and inconsistent, but I'm trying to get things to work. Why didn't you come here? Lady. Yeah. It's all these are all impassable. No. Ah, now I'm out of ink. Go back. I don't want to waste ink making you turn around. Uh, right, how do I make her go left? Why doesn't why does stuff just not work most of the time? God damn. Come on. Please. <sighs> These controls are frustrating sometimes. There's a reason why gesture controls are almost always tried like once, and then you're like, you know what, actually, buttons were fine. Oh, now she did it. Okay, cool. Come on. I just lost an entire minute to that, but cool. What am I gonna do here? Okay. Okay. Ah, oh, fuck. Time's work, please. Get out of the water. Gah. I don't like these. I just I don't like this level. <laughs> I do not I do not enjoy the fucking Tetris Plus levels. It'd be one thing if it was just a little like, oh man, look at them wandering around all hapless. Are you gonna make it? But it's like the actual controls just don't work so often that the whole thing gets really frustrating. This is where all the comments are like, oh weird, it worked perfectly for me. Because I have a perfect recall of when I was 10. You don't, by the way. <laughs> ah, fuck. I'm out of ink, and also this entire path is useless. Because this is a hard floor, so this was not an, a valid alternate approach compared to last time. Oh, man. 
might even be slower. Actually, it's probably right. They reshuffled the level, so. No! Why are you going that way? Uh. Uh, oh yeah, this, this breaks. Ah, fuck. Ah, fuck. Fuck! Can you chill for a second? Yeah, I forgot. I, I tried taking a different path, but they reshuffled the whole level. So there is no different path, because the other, the previous layout doesn't exist anymore. Unless it does, I'm not sure. This looks familiar. Maybe I did just take a way short, a way, a way longer path to the same place. I thought it was randomized each time. Please, I beg you, work. And then it, it just threw her off perfectly. Why only sometimes? Yeah, the treasure's gone, so I guess it is the same thing every time. So that was an alternate path. It's just a much, much worse one. It worked! Quick, 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 Oh god, there's so much sp- Ah! Quickly! Okay, yeah, we're fine. We have like a whole minute left. I just don't know what they could be interpreting those gestures as, if not exactly what I want them to be. I'm drawing a vertical line out of a piece of- out of a- a water tile that should just work, right? Then ha and then, like, it took, like, several attempts to get her to just come out of it. Which is clearly the intended outcome. I don't- I don't know what's going on there. Neat! Bamboo girl? What the heck? The character with the fishbowl on their head was an alien! Who could have guessed? <laughs> Looks like a bamboo shoot, except it's metal and insanely huge, so nothing like a bamboo shoot. This... This is what was calling me. It's the link to my mysterious past. Kaguya. I knew. I knew that this giant bamboo shoot was buried here, in Sasa Sanctuary. You did? But... One day, many years ago, I came here to cut down some bamboo. Suddenly, this giant bamboo shoot appeared right before my eyes. Your cold and nearly lifeless body came tumbling out. Then... This giant bamboo shoot disappeared back into the ground. You were as cold as ice. It looked like you might die at any minute. I quickly picked you up and rushed you home. My dearly departed wife and I nursed you back to health. We had always wanted a child. You were like a blessing from the heavens. You brought joy into our lives. I couldn't tell you the truth. I feared that if you found out, you would seek out this strange bamboo shoot. I feared that it would take you away from us forever. Don't go. Don't go, Kaguya. Grandfather? <laughs> I always thought of you and dearly departed grandmother as my real family. And that feeling shall never fade. Though I may leave, my, fa my heart remains with you. Remember that. But I cannot stay here with you. A mysterious force is calling me. I cannot resist. I must discover where I came from. 
Don't worry, I will come back to you. I just need to know. So I beg you, oh grandfather dear, see me off with a smile on your face. Okay, I will, Kaguya. Go wherever you may. I only ask that when you get there, you remember one thing. You are my precious grandchild. Never forget that. You are my dearest, most precious grandchild. Oh, grandfather. His precious grandchild? Huh? Oh, I wasn't thinking about home or anything. No, really. Isun, Amaterasu, I'm forever grateful to you. I could never thank you enough for what you did for me. But please accept this as a token of my appreciation. Fire tablet, but that lets me get through the fire. It was my sole link to my mysterious past, but now that I'm returning home, I shall need it no longer. May it help you in your travels. It is time. Time for me to depart. Thank you, you two. Thank you, Grandfather. Farewell, and may we meet again someday. This was sweet, but also, who are you? <laughs> it feels like the ending to a story, but like, I met her like, 20 minutes ago. So I'm like, oh, she was in prison, and I let her out, and then she's an alien, surprise, she's gone now. Maybe it'll come up again later? Maybe it's the beginning of a story? It feels like the game was leading up to this, except for the part where the game didn't lead up to this. What? <laughs> well, it's gone. Wonder where it's headed. I hope the bamboo girl has a safe journey wherever it leads. Hey, Ami, get the light out. We got, we got sidetracked helping that bamboo girl. Let's get going, we have work to do. We gotta retake the- we gotta rake that queen over the coals. She's got some explaining to do. Kaguya, she's gone. So that giant bamboo sprout was a cradle to take her home. My prayers are with you, dearest Kaguya. Kaguya. I've never worked this hard in my bamboo wear before. I'm gonna build a bamboo palace by the time Kaguya returns. My prayers are with you, dearest Kaguya. That was a very different reaction all of a sudden. I fed them already. Yep, everyone's happy around here. Ooh. What's going on over here? Is it money? Yeah, the storytelling there felt a little odd. I think a lot of this game is like references to different elements of mythology and stories and so on, but without the re without the context, it's just like, oh, so that happened. All right, well, that's over. All right, that happened. All right, that's over. <laughs> like, I, she was imprisoned. I had to go inside the guy's belly to make him not uh, poisoning the town. And then she turned out to be an alien and she left. Just, uh, it's a, uh, that's, it's, it's odd. <laughs> There was like two story beats. I meet her and she leaves. But maybe, maybe that'll be the beginning of something. I don't know. I don't know. Mm -hmm.